All right, everybody, how are we doing today? My name is Matt. If you're new here, welcome to the channel, eBay Posh Man. So uh, the other day I made a video, my first uh, one where I went to Ross and kind of tried to uh, go through the shoes and source some of them. And actually I only found a couple of shoes, but the video did really well. And then the other day I did a video where I went to Marshalls, Ross, uh, Burlington and Goodwill and that video seems to be doing pretty well so you know I'm gonna give you what you like that's what I'm gonna do today I'm gonna hit a couple uh, retail stores and then a couple of Goodwills and hopefully have some good luck take you in the store show you some items that they have there and I'll just go ahead and uh, show you before I leave the store what I picked up so that way at the end of the video I won't have to you know set everything out and uh, you know edit some more and stuff so just going to show you what I find today. Had pretty good sales this weekend. Most of my sales were pre-owned shoes, but I think I shipped out 14 or 15 today. So thanks for watching. If you are new here, do me a huge favor. Subscribe. If you enjoy the video, of course, comment. And uh, go ahead, give me a thumbs up, and we'll see you in just a minute. All right, everybody. We start out at Ross. These shoes are on clearance, $27.99. Some small Adidas size five got some uh, pumas gonna show you a couple shoes that I passed on that maybe I shouldn't I don't know let me know your opinion as soon as I pick these up the dreaded alarm goes off and after I get that situated I'm trying to film again these are some Nike trail running shoes women's size 10.5 uh, $50 I think they'll make some money and I might pick those up in the future I just didn't do it that day and here's also some shoes that I passed on that I definitely should have picked up these are some Nike Air Force ones kind of like rose gold those were $49.99 got some more Adidas a hey, please stay to the end of the video I'm gonna show you some shoes that I sold uh, recently that you probably want to be on the lookout for when you're out there sourcing uh, so what we got here got some feline look like kind of boot sneakers got some of these Reeboks with the camouflage bottoms one good thing about sourcing often is you're definitely going to spot new shoes because you're familiar uh, with what the store has you've already looked up stuff these are some LeBron witness uh, I think these were like $55 okay I did pick up some of these Adidas Pusha T I lost some of the footage uh, from Ross but I'll show you where I made some pictures in a minute of them picked those up for $39.99 I do think those have the potential to sell for over a hundred dollars I'm gonna make my way over here to the Bigfoot section and definitely my hat is off to anybody who goes out there and makes these videos and edits them it's definitely not easy those are some Hardens got some LeBrons uh, got some Converse there it's definitely not easy making these videos I'm here at Goodwill somebody put some shoes over here in the toy section I am just trying to maneuver around all these uh, toys. It's like an obstacle course. I like to get in and out of these stores as quick as possible. And mainly I'm just focusing on shoes. So that saves me a lot of time. Definitely if you want to sell anything and everything, you could uh, spend all day in one Goodwill and definitely find some profitable items. I only found uh, two items at this store and I'm getting ready to show them to you uh, one of them is these women's Brooks running shoes those will probably bring 30 or 40 dollars and I did pick up these roller skates for eight dollars they're selling for like 45 to 50 dollars the line was long for a Monday very unusual Monday I don't know why but I wanted to show you this antique sewing machine thought it was pretty cool and thought you might want to see it that's why I put it in the video so I didn't have much luck at this uh, Marshalls but like I said stay to the end of the video I've been doing really well at Marshalls gonna show you some shoes that I've sold recently got some of these bounce I believe those were $39 got some of these totos I believe is how you say it $29.99 new balance 
got some of these blazer low i really like these shoes i probably would have got some if they had my size they were 34.99 but just definitely not a shoe for resale got some of these pure boost i believe it's the drp they were about forty dollars got some under armor shoes if you've watched this far and you enjoyed the video hey go ahead and hit that thumbs up button i'd really appreciate it so next i'm at birdington and i did did find two good items these uh, nike alpha menace two elite cleats 14.99 couldn't believe it they gonna bring anywhere from 75 to 100 dollars and then i got some of these nike zoom victory 5 uh, track shoes they were 12.99 this should bring probably about 50 or 60 dollars uh, speaking of cleats and athletic shoes, got some of these uh, Nike uh, Air Jordan 1s. I found $39.99 at Burlington, sold them for $124 on eBay. So be looking out for those when you're out there. I've already found two pair of those. Got some of these uh, Nike Air Max bow fins I found at Marshalls, $39.99. Sold them on GOAT for $150. You can see the payout there, $126 and 22 cents so definitely a great flip on those uh, this Burlington is definitely trying to rebuild a lot of empty shelves a lot of the same kind of shoes you're probably seeing out there at your Burlington's please go down in the comment sections and let me know how your Burlington's doing got these Nike react element 55s that I sold for 96 plus shipping on Macari I did find those at Marshalls too for $39.99. I had a really good day that day I was out there sourcing, so definitely happy with that sale. I don't know what's going on with all these Supra shoes. They definitely can fool you sometimes. So Supra, just wanted to let you know you're doing a great job of fooling people. Here's some more down here on the bottom. Uh, always be on the lookout for anything Vapor Max. I found these at Ross. They were $49.99. They're women's, the Vapor Max Lite. Sold them on Poshmark for $128. So I was definitely happy with that sale too. And we got some bright orange felines here. These are definitely going to get you noticed. Look at the shelves. They are pretty, pretty bare. Look at that. This is one whole section right here. But hey, Burnington, we know you're gonna rebuild. We're trusting that you're coming back strong. Got some more Adidas here. I know everybody enjoyed that 50% off sale when they reopen, but you clean the shelves out. I didn't get uh, to mine when it opened, but I did end up getting about 29 pairs that afternoon and still did pretty good with what i found but i know some people got some great deals there we're in the book bag section here here's some polo ralph lauren shoes i love polo stuff these were a great price too twelve dollars and 99 cent but the suede was all scuffed up and they were size 13 so i decided to pass on those and we're getting near the end of the video, so I hope you enjoyed it. If you're not subscribed, subscribe to the channel. I'm going to try to be putting out videos for you each and every week. Got some Doc Martens. They were pretty scratched up too, size 12, and they were $49.99. I'm going to show you a couple pre-owned shoes that I sh uh, sold too recently, so... Maybe if you sell pre-owned shoes, got some Hirachi cleats right there. Got some of these Converse uh, with the spell out. I think those ended up being $29.99. And here are some shoes that I sold uh, recently on eBay. These are some Mizuno Wave Prophecy 6 uh, women's shoes. Uh, I paid six dollars for these sold them for thirty nine dollars plus shipping so be on the lookout for Mizuno shoes some do well and some don't do that good but a lot of them uh, will bring some good money definitely for some pre-owned shoes if you can get them at a good price had those polo Ralph Lauren high tops these were only nineteen dollars and ninety nine cent not bad but I think the market's flooded with them these are some Brooks B16. I uh, picked these up for less than $7. 
Sold them for $45 plus shipping on Macari, so definitely a great sale. Hey, if you watched this far, I really appreciate it. I wish you the best of luck out there sourcing. Hey, if you enjoyed it, drop me a comment down below. Remember to subscribe, hit that like button. Everybody be safe out there. Take care and God bless.